Um, I remember I was going to show you the bank, uh, bunker. Also, I was going to show you, because I don't think I showed you this. Uh, when you interact with your bike and go to the under the hood section, there's a storage on the bike. So you can, uh, with your missions or when you're out scavenging, you can load the bike up. And uh, so not only do you get places faster, but you can bring a lot more back with you. So that's pretty significant. So as soon as I get this, uh, this load or this unloaded, then uh, I'm going to go to the bunker and show you the bunker it is kind of cool and I did find a missile silo that I didn't record it was really neat but hopefully that's not what everybody's referring to as a bunker because it was a missile silo and you know this is our medical crate and I think you've already seen this. We're making cement now. Um, or concrete. We have a lot of a lot of concrete made up. And so we were able to repair the walls and we can start building in concrete, which is you know better than the way I'd been building. And I'm gonna stoke this fire because I wanna. There's a lot of brass in there, but I wanna top off the iron if possible. So, back over here. I found several pistols I looted. Um, a motel in the neighboring town. And it was quite productive. So I'm going to get the ingredients for another mini bike to have a, a spare in case something happens to my, the one I'm using, because it can, it can get blown up, among other things, I think. They're not permanent, so I definitely want to, you know, I don't want to be without a mini bike for any length of time. gonna get I'm gonna make I'm gonna make another claw hammer and then I'll merge those that way maybe I can get a really good claw hammer but for now we're gonna go to the bunker And it's down this way. So I don't know if, I think I came in this building before and there were all metal, uh, these metal plates here. So I didn't see this underground area and I guess I have to crouch down to get in and I'm hunted. That's nice. Very nice. So let's put the door on that we brought with us. And we'll just lock that for now. So this is the bunker. There's... A um, few things in it. This is locked. I haven't opened that yet. Alright. So, like I say, if you found this early on, it would be a really cool base. 
Um, if it were further from my primary base, it would be a good secondary base, but none of those um, conditions that I just described apply. Is he beating on that? I don't want him breaking up the door. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. So then we'll go, and this is actually how I got in. Um, this leads up and out, not straight up. Uh, they may be coming down through there, actually. is emptied out. So there's the safe. They didn't empty. What do you have here? No. They're probably doing something on the surface. I don't think they're hitting here yet. Sure does sound like it, doesn't it? Alright, so we're back to where it was. <coughs> mm, excuse me. Let's see, is there anything in there or not? Really. Go ahead and break this open. One of them gets down here with us, and that's you know, fine. We'll just deal with him when he gets here. Yeah, this is hardly worth the trip. Oh well, it's better than nothing. Anyway, so it's well oh, there up there. Anyway, um wanted to show you that and you know I've got it sealed off now. So they can't just wander in. Be out there in the yard. See how much damage they've done. Where are they? Maybe they did go down. See, this is the this is the hatch that I went down. It wasn't open like this, um, but I opened it up. Let's see, they may have went down there and they may be digging around. I don't know what the heck they're doing actually. That's not important. So I showed you the bunker. Was it two thirty? Did I go in this building? <laughs> oh, here they come! Her buddies heard that. Oh, no, get out of there. Oh, goodness. There we go. Um, yeah, that's Buzz's bar. I guess I just didn't notice the antenna on, on top of it. I've already looted these stores. Boy, there's a lot of them wandering around, isn't there? It is a horde day. Coming up on a horde night. Let's see how much gas. Because it's 
54. Alright, let's top it off. <laughs> Not sure what purpose the horn has, but I like it. Nice touch. Um, maybe a multiplayer would have you know, some uses, I don't know, but. Well, and if I didn't mention it, this is a, you can play this in multiplayer, um, co-op and, uh, see, player versus everything, PVE, whatever it is. So these trees are starting to get big. That's nice. They don't seem to be, at least these, uh, this time they're not reaching over the wall. That was not good. The blueberries are not ready. Corn looks ready. Not yet. Neither is the potatoes. So, my crop's about to come in. I've been working on getting rid of this door. That's a heck of a door, though. Oh, I know what I wanted to show you. Yeah, so, we're going to take this tower out. And I took one of the columns down. It was interesting the way it came down. So let's, let's do this and you'll see how things come down. Hopefully this whole thing ain't going to come down on my head. But man, it'll be interesting no matter what. It doesn't, gravity doesn't work quite like it should. I'll say that much. But it, it's better than Minecraft, I guess. It's, isn't saying much either. There it goes. So that's that's how the cookie crumbles. As far as the whole tower, though, this is going to be interesting. I'm thinking that. Oh my goodness, this is going to end badly, isn't it? Uh, I don't know if there's water in this thing or not. It, it's definitely a water tower, but... Water's not modeled perfectly either, I'll say that. But they know, and, you know, I think they're trying to make it better. It's good enough. Um, this, <laughs> this should be coming down fairly soon. Uh, Alright, so I'll keep that one and I'll go for this one. Let's see what happens. Okay, so that took out that leg. That whole thing might, and and I actually did have one game where it wasn't something this big, but it was pretty big. Um, and it ended up, there was a platform in midair is what I'm trying to say. So it's possible to have some strange effects. But I'm hoping this will come down. Uh, one good thing is it doesn't wreck things when it comes down. I think it can hurt me, but it won't like keel over and crush that building. I should take out the ladder. <laughs> I'm gonna hit it right there. That should go quick. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, the whole thing. That's nice. 
And no water. That's interesting. Anyway. So we're coming up on Horde Night. Still take that central tower down, but or central pillar, or whatever. So I'm probably going to uh, take out these pieces of concrete and expand my farmland or I don't know, but I just didn't really need that tower anymore. It doesn't, never really did need it. Yeah, that's going to take a while, so I'm not going to start on that. Still haven't decided about this building. Could make it a cool uh, like entertainment area or something. Let's see how we doing with this building. Looks like everything's pretty well reinforced. These aren't refilling. I don't. I don't know. I'm just gonna leave it. Got the lower section of these towers at least partially reinforced in case they make it inside the gate. And I'm up there defending. I've seen a lot of bases um, where people are making them underground. And some really high up. And they're really cool. But I'm going to try to try not to do that. I'm going to try to keep it low to the ground so that they can keep swarming and maybe break through. I don't want them to break through, obviously, but it seems like you should have the threat of that. And there are ways, um, if you go on YouTube, you'll see them. There's ways to pretty much zombie proof your location or your base and while I'm doing that to some extent I want to keep some of it some vulnerability I guess so I think I told you I think actually you've seen now the cops and cops explode so well this doesn't seem to be a particularly vulnerable area area of the base if one of them gets in here um, it's always good to have 
everything reinforced. Plus the role playing aspect to me is, you know, you don't want to use your knowledge of the game's weaknesses to uh, exploit the, or exploit the weaknesses. So I'm going to pretend like I need to reinforce everything, even if I don't. So let's, whoa, I knew that was going to happen sooner or later. I keep overshooting that corner. I need to put a railing there. All right. Is that all that's going in here? Yes, it is. So I should pick a weapon for defense. Um, I'm not going to use a bow and wooden arrows, that's for sure. Let's just keep topping this off. All right. Now I should have my hammer. All right, what weapon do I want to use? 65 rounds, 436, but my SMG is not very good, is it? I should just... See if I can't get a pistol up to snuff. I, mean, I found all these pistols in the toilets. So they're kind of smelly. This is why I don't even buy these or pick these up anymore. This isn't worth carrying. But if it comes as part of a pistol, obviously I'm going to keep it. Come on. Coming up on time. Alright, that's as good as the pistol's gonna get. I will put it in the eight slot and get it loaded. Alright. Yep. I'm at 10 minutes. So I'm going to close this door. I need to improve the editing. And let's go up here and see if we can figure out where trouble's coming from. them already. Nope, they just might be on the far side if they are. That's one of my strongest areas for defense. 
Not necessarily for engaging them, though. There's a weakness. Let me see. No. Hmm. Out front, maybe? Okay. Where are you guys at? Oh. <laughs> yeah, them spikes is sharp, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh boy. I wonder. Ooh. Oh, that's right. I forgot to show you. Darn. Okay, well, this right there is a mine, and there used to be another one right there. I bought those from the trader. And that dog found one of them. Oh, hello. Calm down. This will be over soon. Nice. Oh. I hate those things. Those monkey boys. Comes closer every time I shoot him. Oh, weird. All right. You and your buddy. Why am Level five. That's all I am with pistols. My goodness. It's not like I've had a lot of shooting, target shooting. Right, here comes some more of the burning guys. There's a lot of them. Him, aren't I? My goodness. All right. I see a bunch of them still coming. Four, five. Oh, what was that? Oh, that was a body exploding. Seen any cops yet? What are you guys doing? We did the mesh. The monster mesh. Pistol definitely much better than the bow. And there comes a wiggly man. There goes a wiggly man. This guy. He's attacking the rock. He's mad. 
Nah, I am just wasting ammo. We'll wait till they get closer. I have a lot of this ammo, but it's just it's wasting it. Is that dog dead? Or is it just sitting there? It's, must be dead. Yeah. You again? Oh, she found the other mine. Nice. <laughs> I just got lucky. I only bought two of them and I just happened to put them in the area they came from. They haven't came from that direction yet, which is a good thing. My defenses are stronger over here. No, no, that's right. I've got a second trench over there that's starting to get pretty beefy. We need to put another firing position over there, though. Hmm. There's one of them monkey boys. That's too far. Sounds like I could hear something. They may have. I think I mentioned it before that sometimes you get bands coming from uh, not from the main assault direction. And they might just be the normal roving horde that you get. And it just happens to be that it comes on the same night as uh, the main horde. I can hear him now. He might have petered out. Yeah. Probably a few hit around here. At any rate, and you see how effective those stakes are. I mean, I'm really not in much danger. Had to defend the wall. Oh. Spoke too soon. Some more. This is not over. Not at all. Oh boy. Obviously, murdering zombies is a great, great way to level up. 
weight weight way if you're uh, what's the guy that I hunted Bugs Bunny oh I haven't seen one of that guy yet tonight don't miss him you just leave it alone what was his name Elmer Fudd was that, yeah I think it was Elmer Fudd Five minutes. Dude, you just need to go down. That's either a spider or a crawler. I think it's a spider guy, yeah. Did I mention I don't like those guys? I think I did. It's weird you hit him and he comes closer. Falls toward you. Well. That just might be it, folks. He was like 120 rounds or something. He started with, I think it was 240. At any rate, <laughs> that's not cheap. I need to think about getting some more bullets. I can make a crossbow now, I have the recipe, but I actually like the bow better than the crossbow because the crossbow doesn't have, uh, I don't like its targeting. It's good. As much, whatever. All right, so there's, there's sun up. Now I'll go loot the bodies. Take my pistol with me. I should, I think I might be hungry. Let's see. Yeah. everything up there we go look at that we're up to 121 now not bad after we got knocked back badly there was several deaths I know I'm gonna need wood to repair the stakes make ones or replace uh, ones that are completely destroyed I'm gonna get one of these trees If you look in the lower right, you'll see where I got the seeds. So when I chop the tree down, I got two seeds. So I took down a tree, and I have two more and as soon as they grow. So it's obviously a renewable resource. Unless I get swarmed, I'm just going to use the hammer to take out the stragglers. You know what? They didn't get up here. These are old. Uh, it's from an old swarm that came by. Just a regular swarm. Grocery delivery here, isn't it? Key pod.
Anyway. Looks like the major excitement's over. We'll go ahead and finish looting these and then uh, call it quits for now. Yeah, really not that much damage. Uh, whoa! Yes, oh great, I'm on the stakes. Oh no. <laughs> you have to keep your eye out while you're out here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Ladies, calm down. Me too. Alright, um, there's a couple more coming, alright. Alright, everybody, bring me your groceries. Gosh, I can't believe I got banged up on this. What? Oh, there you go. Freaking frack coming. Hi. Listen. Go away. You go away. Some inventory maintenance. I'm gonna quiet down for a little bit. Looks like it. Care about this stuff. Just don't care about that stuff. doing before so you get the idea sometimes they do bring some really good stuff this is the ones that found my mind over here. I don't know if you can get struck by lightning. I guess no, but you never know. yet all right so you saw oh, there's a feller coming let's just see what your buddy had oh. Fiber. I think that might be the first piece I found in this game. Before. Oh. Need 
that. All right. Yeah, oh, so they did get down here. What? All right. Maybe these are those faint ones that I heard that I couldn't find. One point. Oh, you know what? Ah. Their most successful uh, assault was down here, wasn't it? I'm actually going to have to another stake for here. Okay. That's it for now. Thanks for watching.